Davis. Nice. Yeah. They have played throughout the U.S., defeating teams from Southern California, Oregon, Texas, Colorado, Illinois, Maryland, and Florida. In 2016, this team became the first in California to be, top, to be ranked in the Lacrosse Magazine Top National 25, and currently this year they are ranked number eight. One of our players uh, broke the national record last year in goals scored over 160, and I think right now she's over 134 and counting Go as Chuck. of last Go week. Chuck. And <laughs> under their coach, they've uh, had record-breaking points in a season of 230. Wow. They've been ranked number one west of the Mississippi for three years in a row, and they went out to Florida this year and played the number one team, um, McDonough. I can't face them without getting <laughs> In 2012, the direction of the Nevada girls lacrosse team would be forever changed. Nobody could have imagined what the next seven years would hold. As a coach, Rory does not necessarily believe in talent, but believes that an obsession leads to talent. Rory, it was your demand of doing drills over and over until you saw better in building the repetition that developed the girls' obsession for being the best. Talent is not the result of one's natural gifts. It's showing up day after day, putting in the work. The girls under your coaching became obsessed with what they could become. All of us have potential. However, Rory knows the difference is what you choose to do with that potential. He has built teams that rise up and keep pushing. It is in the process that they have achieved their success. With Rory, it is not a question if you can, but if you're willing. Rory did not know the sport of lacrosse when he agreed to coach. He only knew his niece needed a coach. Rory is a great example of a person with big dreams is more powerful than the person with all the facts. A great coach will take you to a place you have never been before and one you might not get to on your own. Girls, you are so good that people look at you as an excuse not to try. Alumni and current players, you became so good that people refused to believe that they could be that good. You have succeeded as a team year after year because you keep going and going, always demanding more, refusing to be held back by anything. You all have been willing to take the knocks, make the sacrifices, been willing to suffer. A person that keeps going can't be defeated. Along this amazing journey, the Nevada Girls Across team earned an assistant coach named Sam Neff. The constant motivator, <laughs> Sam demonstrates mm -hmm. that success needs your time and attention. He sees that spark of determination in each player. He has taught these players to look at what they are doing wrong with no loss of pride. Together, Rory, Sam, and these girls have ventured into the unknown, accomplished things that others thought were impossible. So many people are saying there would never be another team like this, but I believe there could be if you find coaches and players brave enough to dream bigger. Rory, we have tried to make this not too much about you. <laughs> for your strong dislike of public recognition. <laughs> so I will, I will leave you with this. As a good, a good coach prepares you for the game, a great coach prepares you for life. Rory, you are a great coach. Yeah.